Okay, so today we're gonna introduce the Panda 356HV model of the washer um, for the clothes. Um, as you can see, this is the inside capacity. It's not that small. It's it's enough for a for a family which lives in an apartment where they don't have a big space to uh, keep the big washer and dryer. Um, it is not that small that you think. I was thinking of a small uh, washer, but it's not. It is enough for a family of, let's say, four or five. Um, you can wash everything unless it's too big. That will not fit. So I'm going to show how you can start, like you can plug in the, um, the pipe here for the water and you have the warm and the cold water here. Um, <clears throat> once you plug that in, you can uh, flow the other output water into the sink or whatever you would like. So I have a string here to hold on to it because when it pumps out the water, it's gonna pump it um, forcefully and this will not hold on here so I have a string just put in there um, to hold on to it uh, you can put that somewhere else as well but now uh, let me put clothes like you can see how much you can put in um, so I can put in this I can put in this Here, so another one. This one. So this is. These are some of them are adults and some of them are for the kids. So as you can see, so you can put in this. This one, this one, put in this one, and finally put in this one and this one. So let's say this is enough. Now what you can do is just cover it. Oh, I think I'm, uh, I need to put in the the washing liquid so you can just don't put them all at once just put them bit by bit That is the washing liquid. I believe you can put in some um, some fragrance, like to make good smell, like a softener or something. You can put that here. So it clearly says softener here. You can just. And then you can put in, um, I think this is the, the liquid that smells good, so it makes the clothes smell good. 
that one I put in here that was the softener and you can just simply put it on here as well if you would like now we can cover and then we can just simply turn on the water the hot water it's not hot but it's warm and you can turn in the cold as well so you have the turn on butter here and then you can just um, uh, choose here so here it says normal standard uh, quick wash heavy duty whichever you want to um, choose but let me see I'm gonna just choose um, the quick wash that's number three and then you can just start here that's the start <laughs> So now it's gonna um, get in as much water as it needs and then start running. So it has like, it says B, B, or double B, it says um, the number three, like, um, wash over here, number two, like A, A is soak, B, B is wash, C, C is rinse, D, D is spin. So right now it's B, B, which means wash. That's gonna do this for 22 seconds, 22 minutes, sorry. Well, once you washed, um, I mean, if you would like, you can use the number 10 on air dry. You can leave that for 30 minutes or 20 minutes. It's gonna dry the load a little bit. It's, it's not totally dried, but you can just put it or hang it on somewhere inside your apartment and it's gonna be dried completely um, in a few hours. So now it's starting to uh, spin. It's not too noisy. It's just a little bit of noise. It's um, quiet. Like if you. If I close this door, you will um, rarely hear the sound outside. But this was just a basic introduction on how to use it. It's not an ad or advertisement. It's just to help people who would like to buy Honda or this model. I have had this for a month now. It runs without issues. Um, it's not too bad. It's, it's a good, um, good washing machine for an apartment. Plus, you can you can also buy the, uh, the thing underneath that you can move it easily. You can move this thing everywhere you want. That's it for this video, I believe, and thank you. I took off my water filter.
The adapter works really well. Even though I had bought one, I realized I didn't need to. And it is working while my dishwasher is running. It's running. And the tap. Kind 